Hello everyone, how are you? Is this Crystal? She'll be assisting Hi. today. <clears throat> and then you know how to look at all the chats and everything, right, Crystal? Yes. I do, thank you. Alrighty. You ready to get started? I am ready to get started. Let's go. So I think the first question that we're going to cover is how do we find our affiliate ID? So your affiliate ID, you're just going to go into your dashboard. Your dashboard will look like this, which is on the screen. Um, you would just click on the home button for dashboard. And then your affiliate ID is always going to be the second set of digits in your affiliate link. So after dot com, like 5394 is your account ID um, that you're running the campaign on. And then 1610, that would be your affiliate ID. And that's how you can find that or track that and use that to discuss with anyone in accounting or not accounting. Um, your account manager, your account uh your account person, your affiliate manager. Um, but yeah, so that's how you'd find that. Just a second set of digits in your affiliate link. All right, thank you so much. And then I think our next question is, how do I know which CPA payout I'm on? Um, so again, if you go to your dashboard, you just click on the home button right here, and you go down to your affiliate links, your CPA or your payout that you're receiving um, will be right here. So right now it's flat belly fix and it's a $40 CPA. So that's how much money you'll be getting paid for each conversion or sale that you have regarding whatever campaign you're running. All right. Excellent. Our first question from one of our viewers and guests is where can we get a link to the previous recorded webinar? And I can answer that one and I'll post the link to our YouTube in the chats. Um, we upload all of our previous webinars to our YouTube page. And if you subscribe to us, then, you know, you can stay up to date with all of the info and whatnot that we post on there as well. So and that's for Tatiana. Thank you so much, Crystal. Any other questions, concerns, comments? I have another question. <laughs> okay, what's your question? What are the top campaigns right now on Facebook? Top campaigns on Facebook currently? Um, it would be Free Bible. Uh, that's a really good one. Uh, Backpack, Free Stuff Offer, uh, Venus, VFX. Um, it's a really good offer. Erase My Back Pain is also doing really well. And Flat Belly Fix is also doing very, very well. Um, so those would be the top Facebook campaigns. So Backpack, uh, Free Bible, Venus, um, which is ideal for Facebook and native, Erase My Back Pain, and Flat Belly Fix. Wonderful. Thank you. You're welcome. And we'll get those posted in the chat for you guys as well. Um, what offers are doing the most volume currently? Offers that are doing the most volume currently across network wide, um, I would say Sugar Balance is doing very well. Um, healthy Blood Pressure Protocol, it's BPS, um, BPS5. Uh, South Beach Skin Lab is doing very well. Herpes Clear Defense is doing very well. And Flat Belly Fix is doing extremely well as well. Um, but let's say you wanted the top campaigns for email. Um, best campaigns for email would be Prime Potence, Pure Health Fungus Eliminator, um, Herpes Clear, and then if you wanted to run certain campaigns on display, uh, the best campaigns for display currently are Sugar Balance, Vision 2020, and Fungus Hacks. then that, those are the best ones. Sorry about that, Farron. I have a hard time typing and talking at the same time I was getting our YouTube link put into the chat. Um, thank fine. you so much for that. And I do have a next question as well. Where, how do I place a post back pixel and what variables do we accept? Okay, place a post back pixel. 
Um, with that, I mean, sometimes people get confused in placing their own post back pixels. So if you guys ever have any questions or concerns, you can always ask your account manager or come to me, ask me or Anna, um, just so there's no confusion at all and everything tracks correctly. But if you were going to place it yourself, um, you would just go to the settings tab, which is this tab right here, and you're going to click on that. And then you're just going to go to post back pixels, which is this tab right here. Click on that, and then you would go to add new pixel. And it shows you the dynamic variables that you can use that we accept. So you would just input these um, where you would in your link. And then you would go to up here where it says URL. So you'd attach all of your dynamic variables that you want to add. And then after that, you would hit save. And then your post back pixel would be added. Thank you so much. That seems pretty simple, actually. Yeah, it's not. It's definitely not hard. For status, make sure it says active. For event, always make sure it says purchase. I mean, it's already naturally and normally and automatically like that, so you don't have to change those. Um, but just make sure that's what they say, active and purchase. All right, and we have a question from our guests, which one of them from Tatiana again, is which other offer traffic sources are good for the top offers? Um, for the top offers, like I said, for email, best is Prime Potence, Pure Health, Fungus Eliminator, and uh, Herpes Clear. Um, for display, Sugar Balance, Vision 2020, Fungus Hacks. The top ones, um, most of them, all traffic types are allowed, like Healthy Blood Pressure Protocol, all traffic types are allowed, just no incent. Uh, South Beach Skin Lab, all are allowed except bidding and branded keywords on search. Um, so no search, and um, that's the most for that's for a lot of our campaigns. Also, a lot of um, traffic sources are allowed except for SEO, search, and PPC. Um, so I mean, yeah, you can just get with your account manager and discuss which traffic types you're interested in running. Um, mostly all traffic types are allowed. Usually the main ones that aren't allowed are SEO, incent, and search. But again, it it varies from offer to offer. So that's when you would just get with your account manager and make sure you're following the restrictions. That way your link wouldn't get cut or wouldn't get rescinded or conversions or anything like that. All right, thank you so very much for that. We have a question, another question from our guest, which is, do you have any examples of a landing page for Facebook? Of a landing page for Facebook? Well, I'm currently on the Flat Belly Fix campaign, um, so I can just to this one for you. So this is a landing page that was doing very, very well on Facebook. Um, I've had a few affiliates doing amazingly well. Um, and they would just, you can either cloak, um, which some affiliates are doing, which, clo which is just cloaking your links, or you can direct run it to Facebook. This is uh, one of our Facebook approved offers. So you shouldn't have an issue getting it approved. Um, and if you do, you can just contact your account manager or anyone else at MaxWeb, and then um, we can help get that sorted for you. Okay. And, and Tatiana wanted to um, reiterate on her question. She meant traffic sources for, like, Outbrain, Rev Content, Taboola, MGID. Um, so you mean for, like, native campaigns? Yes. Uh, which campaigns are doing the best on native? Taboola. I mean, a lot of our BSLs are meant for native campaigns. So, I mean, we all have connections at Taboola and Outbrain and Rev Content. Um, so, if you're looking to run campaigns on those, um, it wouldn't be an issue. Uh, we can definitely help get that sorted for you. Um, also, one second, this. Some of our best native campaigns currently are, I'm just pulling them up, making sure I have all the stats correctly. Um, Herpes Clear is great for native. Vision 2020 is another one that's great for native. Um, Pure Nails, Sugar Balance, Flat Belly Flix is great for native as well. Um, pretty much any of our offers that are VSLs, which is what we mainly focus on, are VSL offers. Um, those are all really great for native. So Taboola, Rev, Conference, Rev Content, Outbrain, um, you can pretty much run all of those on native. 
Uh, Instahard is another good one. Prime Potence is a great one. South Beach is great. Uh, Ringies, which is tinnitus, is great. Tinnitus 911 is also another killer offer. So um, most of our offers are built for native traffic, and VSLs are the best for native. All right, thank you so much for that. No Our next question is going to be, what is the best way to reach you? What is the best way to reach us at Max Web? Uh, best way would be, I mean, you can reach out to me personally. I'll put my Skype in a chat for everyone. Um, also, Fabian, Crystal, Daisy, Anna, um, also emailing us. We also have a 24-hour support chat as well. Um, so that's an amazing way to reach us also. But definitely Skype. Skype is the number one email also. Um, my email is just faron.gator at maxweb.com. And same with Anna's, it's just anna.gita at maxweb.com. So really easy and we're always around so you can definitely reach out to whomever, whenever, and we'll get you sorted. All right, thank you so much for that. And then how do I keep track of my commissions and performance? Okay, so you can definitely keep track of what, some of your commissions right here and your, your performance, especially down here it says performance, so you can see like how many conversions you got, how many refunds you may have had, if any, um, and you can like range this or break it down from any date range. The best way to keep track of all of your commissions though is definitely going to the commissions tab, which is this right here, and then going to your commissions log. And then that's where you can see all of the commissions you've ever gotten or that you ever made. And this is the best way to keep track of all of the commissions you have. Um, so that's what I would suggest. And it's pretty easy. Like I said, just the commissions tab, commissions log. I know some people might want to look at conversions or payments or allowances. But again, if you're trying to keep track of all of your commissions and all of your conversions, commission log is the place to be. All right. Wonderful. And I posted, I'm sorry, they're all kind of run together, but the all of our live Skypes in the chat as well. Um, Paul has a question. Do we have any idea on creating content for native ads? And also, do we make any post back URLs available? Um, I mean, well, us making post back URLs available, you'd have to give us your post back URL, but we can work with you to um, create that for you. As far as native ads go, um, we can definitely work with you to help create some solid native ads. Um, but like I said, again, if you guys need help running on Taboola or Outbrain or Rev Content, I know Anna has a bunch of friends at those uh, platforms, and then I know a few people too. So getting you approved is the main thing we'd have to do first, and that wouldn't be too much of an issue. And then after that, we could get like native ads that are doing well for you or help you help you create some, um, we're always around, super flexible. So whatever you need, really. All right, thank you. And that's all of the questions I have. Does anybody else have any questions for us today? Is there anything we can show you how to do? Um. Yeah, any questions at all, uh, just let us know. And happy to help. Um, like I said, definitely reach out to us on Skype or via email. Um, I'm going to throw in our 24-hour affiliate Skype as well, just so everyone has that. Um, that's another great way to reach pretty much all of us. So let me find that. Here's this for everyone, just in case you need it. And like I said, that's our 24-hour Skype chat. Um, and here's mine again. I'm always available as well, no matter what time of the day it is. Um, so you can always reach out to me for our Skype chat. Do we have smart links, Christopher asked. Um, I know a lot of networks and other people are doing smart links right now. We're not so much, we haven't started doing smart links probably something to get into, which I can have a discussion with Anna about. Um, but currently, no, we're not doing too much with smart links ourselves. But who knows, we'll probably do that in the future. I know a lot of people are doing that and it's working well for 
quite a few networks or just people running campaigns, especially like dating campaigns. But it's definitely something we'll look into, and we should. We'll make sure to make a note of that to mention that to Anna. And I went ahead and listed some of the good Facebook campaigns in the chat as well. And if you're interested in any of those, um, and you can just reach out to us or apply for those through the campaign site on our website. Absolutely. Thank you so much, Crystal. You're welcome. Anytime. And do we have any other questions regarding anything else? Or we're still around? This is a short one today, a little bit. Um, Tatiana has a different question. She said, where are you located? I'm actually asking, is PayPal okay for payments, or do you use other payment systems like Pioneer? Um, Pioneer, we don't really use PayPal ourselves. Um, but for us paying you, uh, we do pay weekly, every week, automatically. So let's say you needed to set up your payment system. We also accept ACH. Um, we're located, our home base is in Delaware, uh, but we have offices all around. So like Anna's in Romania, I'm in Las Vegas, Crystal is in Virginia, soon to be Florida. Um, so we have offices all over the world, for, like essentially. Um, but our home base is the U.S. That's a really good question. We have a lot of people all over the place. We, we're definitely very um, well blended. Um, that's a great team. But yeah, to add to your payment details, you would just go to settings. Um, this is where I taught you how to do post back pixels right here, and then payment details right here. You can just log in there, update all your payment details, and then you, can, you wouldn't need to do that for anything else. So that's where you could do that. And then, uh, like I said, payments are sent out every Wednesday automatically. And we even have the capability of paying up to two to three times a week. Yes, we do. The more money you make, the more times a week you get paid. Exactly. Um, Paul, we do have affiliates. We have affiliates located all over the world, actually. Um, we, I don't know if, do we have any account managers there and that are located in the UK right now? Or is it mainly still just here? Um, but I know we have affiliates that are all over the world. Um, we're a global company. Definitely all over the world. Um, and our affiliate managers, our other account managers, I know, some are in Mexico, um, some are in the UK, yes, and Anna, again, she's in Romania, and she talks to just as many affiliates as I do, so she's always around, <laughs> it's always one of us around, and I know Romania is not the UK, but it's very close. It's very, very close. <laughs> it's closer than what we are, or where we are. Anybody have are. any other questions? No? No. Nope. Come on, I know you guys have some questions. Go ahead and ask them. <laughs> no worries. If not, um, we'll definitely send out a link for everyone again, just so they can look at this webinar or even previous webinars. They had other questions that they might think of later, they might have been answered or talked about in a previous webinar. Or you can just gather your questions for next week as well. Um, make sure to have plenty of them. We'll do these routinely or often. Um, Paul had one final question. Is it possible to guide on offers that are doing well right now? Um, define guide. I mean, absolutely. We can definitely help tell you what's working the best for which offer. Um, like I said earlier, there were certain campaigns that were doing better on email than display. Certain campaigns are doing better on display than email, um, which ones to run on native, which ones to run on Facebook. Uh, we can definitely help guide you so that you're set up for success. So you're not just testing random things and burning random money. Uh, we definitely want you to feel comfortable with us and also make a lot of money with us. But yeah. Yes, most definitely. And yes, Paul, the comments will show up in the replay on the video. They, they sure will, yes. You'll be able to see the comments in the chat and be able to get all the links and all of the information as well in case you haven't had an opportunity to copy it. Um, you can definitely see that on the replay as well. Tatiana says, which offer would you advise to start with right away, like today? Um, today, 
it depends on what traffic source you're running, Tatiana, but um, flat belly fix is definitely a huge one right now. Um, that one's doing amazing. Uh, so that's definitely a winner. Um, but again, it also depends on, you know, what kind of traffic source you're interested in running. Um, South Beach Skin Lab is a winner. Um, Sugar Balance is a winner. Prime Potence is a winner. Um, Pure Health. She's Fungus running native winner. traffic. I don't mean to interrupt you, but she chimed in with she's running native traffic. Okay, native? No, not a problem at all. Uh, definitely Sugar Balance, Vision 2020, Fungus Hacks. Um, so for native, if you were doing that, I would start with probably Sugar Balance today. It's a diabetes campaign, and I can put that in the chat as well. Um, and it's doing really, really great. Definitely one of our top offers. Yes, yes, definitely. And there's the info for that. All righty, if we don't have any more questions or anything, I think that kind of wraps it up for us today. It was a short one, but I think we definitely got a lot of good information. No problem. You're very welcome, Tatiana. Thank you, everyone else, for joining us. Really appreciate it. And again, as Crystal said, we'll be having these weekly. So, I mean, if you have any other questions, I mean, you don't have to wait a week for the next webinar to ask us questions. You can definitely reach out to all of us on Skype, but um, we'll definitely chat again next week as well. We will see you all next week, hopefully. Thanks for joining us. Bye.